Today, an icon of adventure returns. An untamable beast that can go anywhere, do absolutely anything. Welcome to the hardest to reach Lego store in the world. A store that rewards those who seek adventure. The prize, the new Lego Land Rover Classic Defender 90. Except two will be crazy enough to come and find us in the middle of nowhere. Well, only two of the craziest adventurers. Midraha, the first Saudi woman to climb Mount Everest. And Aldo, a Scottish adventurer and extreme locations expert. Who will get there first? So I find it so beautiful that me, daughter of the desert, is driving this car in Scotland. I'm here to go on a really, really, really special adventure. I used to climb on these cliffs here. I'm up for a challenge, I'm an adventurer, and I don't mind a little bit of hardship. But first, muddy tracks, bumpy roads, and all sorts of obstacles stand in their way. Yeah, Raha is a formidable opponent, incredibly competitive. This is his terrain, he's from here. I'm really, really hoping he does get lost. This will be the easy bit on the forestry tracks. Tricky. I don't want to get stuck here. Yeah, all sorts of obstacles. Good. I'm not sure what we're going to see when we get up there. Best case scenario would be press-up competition. My competitive side wants to get there as soon as possible. I can see a yellow Land Rover Defender or big wheels. I can't see Raha anywhere. Look at that! Hey, break! What kept you? I've been here for ages. I heard you got stuck. Arriving up top and seeing that Defender is just incredible. But the race isn't quite over. What's an Hello. adventure without a little play? When was the last time you did a Lego build? I'm not going to tell you my secrets. Just 2,336 pieces left to go. Uh, you can have this. No, you can have that. It's okay. Good. <laughs> and play. Okay. One. Two. Three. Go. <laughs> I haven't built any Lego sets for over 30 years. It takes me back to being a little boy, except years ago I was probably a bit better at it than I am now. It brings back that happiness, that sense of creativity and being able to build and it also teaches you patience. Something I do not have bestowed upon me. As the sun is about to set, we better leave our heroes to it for the night. I'm just kind of like, the sun's coming up, I just want to finish it, I don't care who wins. As if weather conditions aren't already harsh enough, we decided to, well, make it more extreme. <laughs> oh, no way! Man, that was harsh! How does that actually join on? Help myself by looking at yours, how that attached. Ah, <laughs> uh, that way. Yeah, that way. Quite tricky with cold fingers, isn't it? Very. Neck and neck. And finally... Yay! Oh, <laughs> mine broke at the last... Come on, there we go. Come on, come on. Yay! Well done. I think when you go on an adventure with someone, the camaraderie becomes much stronger than the, the adversary, and that's exactly what happened with me and Aldo. Not bad for my first Lego build in over 30 years. By the end of the process, I'd say Raha and I were actually working together and not competing against each other. The cup and the gear stick yeah. actually move. It's so cool. Very cool. My favorite, I think, is the suspension. Yeah, it's very it's cool. very accurate to the real Defender. It's been quite tough, quite rigorous. All the ingredients of a, a really, really good adventure. Our own private this license so plates. so cool. A journey is a collection of experiences. So get lost enough to be found. Be brave enough to take the first step because you'll never know where that's going to lead you. At the end of the day, the spirit of adventure is the real winner. 